On Friday, April 13th, the UNM College of Fine Arts hosted the 6th Annual Arts Unexpected. The event was a campus-wide showcase of work produced by the various fine arts programs at UNM. Dean Kimberly Pinder says the event has grown since its inception several years ago. That first year, many of them had to go into art classes and music classes and say, there's this thing we're going to do in April. <laughs> Will you sign up like with pieces of paper? And it was amazing because they got over 200 people to actually participate that way. And we had, I think, maybe 30 events that first year. And after that, they recommended that we have an online sign-up sheet. Um, it's a multi-month process. We start around November, so we can have everything in place by, by April. Nicholas Jacobson was able to showcase an interactive piece focusing on meditation. I was working with the museum to do this piece, and it was, uh, I believe Tracy was just like, we should do this on Arts Unexpected. I was really excited about that because I feel like it would be a nice way to like contribute to this as well as bring people up into this floor of the museum because of all the, the other great grad work here. I think it's really exciting that the school has provided like a space for basically completely open for anyone to do it. Like I've been talking to some of the undergrads that I help teach and just basically like fill out because you get in and like no matter what you think your work is, there's people who are going to like it. And like, that's the point of making art, is to share it. It's really generous of the college to provide this time and space for us to be able to share this with the greater community. I'm very happy at how much community this event has built within the college. And I know many people think that painters and violinists hang out together, but they don't at all. But they do during Arts Unexpected. So that was one of the main goals of the event, is for the art students here at UNM to feel like they're in an art school for at least one day, um, where they can go around and see each other's work. And that has been a great success.